a good website helps attract the necessary audience. Now that we have a course ready on our LMS, let's set up our website for it. We'll start by adding a logo. From the awesome bar, search for website settings. This is where we do the configuration of our website. You will see a section called brand. You can add your logo here. This one will appear at the top left corner of the navigation bar. Similarly, we can add a logo for the footer as well from the section called footer. Let's save and check this on our website. As you can see, the logo is visible at the header and the footer. Let's create a basic home page for our app. To create a home page, we will use the web page doc type. Search for it from the awesome bar. Give the web page a title and a route. Through the page building block, you can add a lot of component to your page. These are some of the built-in templates provided by Frappe Framework. I'll do a hero section at the top. This will need a title and a subtitle. I want this section to have a grey background. Now we just have one course on the website, but in the future there will be many more. So to highlight some of the popular courses, you can use the template called course cards. Give this section a title. Then from the table down below, select all the courses you want to show in this section. Apart from this, if you want to display some user testimonials, you can do so using the testimonial template. Enter a logo or the image of the user whose testimonial you want to display. Enter the user's name and the content. We can now save the web page. To set this page as the home page of the website, go back to the website settings doc type. Here, set the route of the page. In the home page field, and save. You can now visit the website on the root URL itself and it will show the home page. All the sections that we added are visible here.